Hello YouTube, this is the Hoover and Sons Sports Card Channel. My name is Brandon, and today we're going to do a video that's not for everybody. It's going to be a, another Pirates team set. This year it will be 2002. Um, we're going to take a look at it, but before I get into the cards, I would like to say that if you haven't considered doing this, um, it's really a cool idea. Just take your favorite team, buy some team sets. They're not very expensive. I don't think, uh, I've probably bought 20 or so of the Pirates team sets. I don't think I paid more than five dollars for any of them, um, including '87 with bonds. Uh, you know, it, they're not expensive. Um, if you're if you're collecting on a budget, I'm doing it mostly because I like to look back at the players. Some of them I've forgotten. There's Jimmy Anderson. We'll get into the cards, but um, just a cool idea if you haven't considered it. Operation Shutdown himself, Derek Bell. Famously decided to go sit on a yacht when he was informed that he was going to have to compete for the starting uh, right field spot. Chris Benson, former number one overall draft pick. Had some good years. Never lived up to the hype, though. Maybe one of the more underrated players of this era, Brian Giles. And one of my favorites of all time, Jason Kendall. Actually, I'm going to put Jason Kendall back up there. Pat Mears was a big free agent signing. He got hurt immediately and never lived up to the contract. Abraham Nunez. Omar Oliveras, who had a pretty lengthy career on the pen. Backup catcher Keith Osick. I believe him and Kendall came up at the same time. We're kind of splitting time, and Kendall pulled away and won the job. Uh, Aramis Ramirez. Famously given away to the Cubs. He had a really nice career. Set him up back there. Pat Rapp. Once a pretty highly regarded prospect when the Marlins first came into the league. And we just looked at this guy's rookie card a few days ago. Calvin Pokey Reese. He was another. Uh, he had won two gold gloves by the time we signed him. Armando Rios. Came over uh, from the Giants for in the Jason Schmidt trade. And Todd Ritchie came from Minnesota. He put together some nice years for us. Kip Wells. I believe he came from St. Louis in the Jack Wilson trade. Um, no, wait, can't be. Never mind. Craig Wilson with the gold cup. And the funny thing about that is he had one home run, 32 RBIs. Sorry about the glare. In 88 games and made the uh, Gold Cup. Must have been a weak year for uh, rookies. And there's Jack Wilson. Now I'm trying to remember where Kip Wells came from. Let me look at that. He came from the White Sox. Yeah, he came from the White Sox. Sorry about that. I think we eventually sent him to St. Louis, though. Kevin Young, who had a pretty long career as a first baseman. A little power, definitely a glove guy. And our manager at the time, Lloyd McClendon. And lastly will be the team card, which is pretty cool. So that's it. There you have the 2002 Pirates. A pretty talented team. They just didn't put it together in the wins and losses. But um, nonetheless... Thank you for watching if you made it this far. Um, please consider subscribing if you haven't already. If you have, we really appreciate that. Uh, comment on the video. Let me know what you guys think. Anyway, that's it. Have a great day. Bye.